Come here now, girl. Hello and welcome to Map Making with me, Bon Bon B. I'm Bon Bon B. You, of course, are very, very welcome. Now, there's a slight change to today's show. Um, there was a little bit of a problem. Now, I recorded a good half hour of, um, of build and, well, the save was corrupted. Which meant one of two things. Either I delete everything I did or go back to the last save, which is what I'd probably do, and redo it all again. Or accept that the save's been lost and corrupted, and um, I don't know what caused it. It's, it's never happened. Never happened. I know I've had some problems with lagging before, um, and quite recently using my software, but um, never, ever, ever lost a save file in uh, the rendering process. So, anyway, long story short is. Um, I decided the best thing to do is we could we do a, a bit of a recap episode today and whilst I do the recap I'll um, also show you what I've built in uh, in the last uh, what well, last seven days which was like I say just half an hour of, I don't have much time for this but half an hour of build in the last seven days right let's start off with the stuff that um, you if you're a regular you'll already know and then if you're not a regular then uh, hopefully this first bit will make you go wow and then um, we'll work we'll work down from the completed bits to the the less completed bits and the newest bits last yeah so anyway let's start I'll start up here so yeah here's the uh, the general map shape uh, this is a map that's going to be used uh, for, you can play vanilla but uh, it's intended to be used with TPBs so TP TPB, that's right, my brain's gone. TPB's uh, Tides mod uh, is the intention. Uh, I'm working really hard on making sure that the vanilla map looks okay, and then we'll work on the uh, on the undersea and make sure that works okay. And so there'll be two options: you can play it vanilla, or you can play it with the Tides mod. And there we go. Right, so that's the overall. We'll have um, down here was like a bit of mainland. Uh, we'll have um, we'll have some rail coming in here, probably dead ending about here, I guess. Just not not much. Just given an option for rail, of course. Uh, and then we've got uh, we've got the wide river here, and then over here is uh, obviously a chunk of mainland again, where the highways will come in. Probably just have one looping around here. I did have a highway down here actually, not a completed one. It just disappeared. I don't know why, it just did. <laughs> I think I may have deleted it and forgotten that I deleted it, but there we are. Anyway, um, it will come across here down this causeway uh, via bridges, across here, across bridges, little tunnel through here, emerging bridge onto the main land, main island part here. That's the plan. Now, first thing we built and completed is the lighthouse island. Ooh, the essential lighthouse island. This one down here. Now this, I'm pretty happy with. I can't see that I'm going to be doing much to change this, to be honest with you. We've got uh, some, I'm quite happy with the, uh, the rock work there. We've got the, uh, the jetty here, a little secluded little cove going on here. And um, obviously, derelict, derelict jetty, the derelict jetty. Um, and uh, if we come down here, you'll see how it merges into the land just perfectly. So you can climb up onto the jetty to get to your boat. It's all overgrown. And then we've got an old path that's worn down. You can actually, if I pull back, you can just about make out the path coming up here. Where it's been trodden down. And then it bends around this way. Not down towards the, uh, the beach there. But up. And then around here. And across here. And then... It goes down to the lighthouse, the essential lighthouse there. I think that's a perfect location for the lighthouse as well. We've got a couple of sand banks. Um, I'm probably going to have to do a little bit more. Well, I'm going to have to do a lot of underwater work to make sure the map works properly with the mod. But I'm quite happy with how this looks. Um, I think there's a little bit of a uh, little bit of water glitching, possibly. There's a little bit of water glitching there. There's so just some minor tweaking is going to be need to be done just to make sure that uh, we don't have any ugly water glitching 
once uh, once it's done. A little bit of a sand bar around here as well. So anyway, I'm quite happy with the way that that little island has turned out. Um, I concentrated on uh, getting that done so I could say, do you know what, I've finished one part of it. Now, that's your main island. Now this main island has got about four tiles worth of built space on it. This secondary island, this is actually out of the uh, 25 tiles um, central built area. Literally, um, the 25 tiles comes up to, I think the corner of it is literally at this point here. doesn't quite make the land. And uh, that's the intention of that is so that anybody who wants more than four tiles, because four tiles isn't much, correct? Yeah, that's correct. Um, there's the option to expand out. This is all buildable buildable place space right now what we spent in the last couple of days uh, last couple of weeks sorry a couple of days is just given the hint of farmland with uh, hedgerows now there's a few things about these hedgerows I want to change or tweak for example let's have a I mean you see you can see where I've been um, copying and pasting so we've got little little batch like that if we go directly across this way and it's there and it's copied to there and come back here and it's copied to there so you can see it's just copy 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 so I'm gonna come back and do some tweaking just to make it less copied and pasted but uh, still it will still look pretty much like that just tidied up really this uh, this main road that goes up between the uh, the fields it's way too wide for a um, for a farm track but it's just to give the hint of of farm track it's not actually supposed to be a farm track and then we came up here there's a little little turn off here see that little little track there comes off around here comes down the side into this little like could be a little picnicky type area and then when you're down here there's a little entrance here you can see it's all sort of like opens up got the uh, these two logs that sort of like angle you down this way and then when you come down this way, you get to the lake. Once again, we've got the abandoned jetty again. This one's completely overgrown though. You can see there, it doesn't even reach, well, it does reach the water. I mean, we have water under here, but um, the actual open water, it doesn't reach it. And uh, I'm quite happy with the lake. I don't think there's gonna be much we'll do in here. Um, I'm quite happy with all of it. Just a little bit of hint of um, detailing along here as well and at the end here too so anyway yes we've got uh, we've got a few options there uh, still got a little bit of work to do with the uh, the beach vegetation but it's still not bad it's still not bad at all right so that's all that and if I pull back across here then uh, this area here now with the shipping there's only one place for the shipping to come in and that's going to be I can be coming across here past the top of this island here so that's about the only place you can have really big docks if you want to have big docks uh, shipping route will come around this side of the island the lighthouse island because it's going to be too shallow over here and when the tide goes out there will be no real shipping route at all you can probably walk to the land possibly and then you'll be able to come down this way and then into that bay which we'll come and have a look at in a moment Right, so anyway, so that's that's that island. That's what the island's all about anyway. Room for, room for docks. At the moment, it's uh, three quarters completed. Um, it's not bad, but it's, uh, I still need to tweak. I mean, I'm not happy with the beaches yet. Um, yeah, you can see the, the sand just looks a bit crappy, doesn't it? So anyway, yes, there's still, still work to do there. Now, what did I do um, in the last part of my build? These hills, there's something a little bit pillowy about them, a little bit lumpy. Uh, that I don't like uh, and to, to be able to get a better feel for the hills I figured let's stick trees where trees would probably go on the hills um, and so sort of like a just done some uh, some tree brushing over the area there and now I'll be able to come back and actually just tinker with the hills and get them sort of like a I know what I a little bit more believable. I'm I'm just not I'm not buying into these hills personally at the moment. They just need um they just need a little bit of um a little bit of TLC, a little bit of care, bringing them up to uh bringing them up to some sort of standard. Um, so yes, at the moment, 
they're okay, but I'm I'm not I'm not super happy with them. Anyway, yeah, so that's the hills. And the uh, the other thing is that I did, I did since uh, since we cut oh down here the beach, did a little bit of tinkering with the beach. Now the beach, you can see where the sand reaches up here. It kind of followed along at that kind of height all the way around here and across the top here. Now the thing was, that was over the top of this, this rocky ledge here. So we had sand going all the way up to the, uh, the foot of these little bushes. Which I didn't figure was realistic at all. I figured there's no way the sand was going to get any higher than this. So I brought the sand down a little bit. I don't mind it there so much. I can just about see it getting up to about there. Maybe bring it down a little bit. But um, down here is all right because it's nice and flat and level. So yes, I'm probably just going to tinker a little bit more with the sand over here. A little bit of a sandbar there as well. So anyway, quite happy with all of that. Now, um, the last time we, you were here, uh, I've done a few more. I've also done a bit, a little bit more tree work here as well. Um, the castle on the top, I had to completely rebuild that. It looks pretty much identical. That's because it is pretty much identical. But um, I had uh, I had some problems, some terrain problems, and I figured the only way to get around it really was just to delete what I'd done, rebuild what I'd done. Um, we will be sticking a tower on the end here, tower on the end on the other side pretty much connecting them up pretty much with an open gap down this end and then um, sort of like a path leading down to this tier and then there'll be some broken walls going across the bottom of this tier and then there'll be also some broken walls and like a castle gate type area at the bottom of this area so um, it'll be sort of like three levels of castle uh, going on there. I'm still thinking about whether or not to put there's an asset on the workshop that I like that I may use in the uh, central castle area there. I'm not sure. I don't think it'll work but I will have a look at it anyway. You can, yeah you don't know till you try do you? The last thing the last thing I've done I started working on this uh, the bay and um, I wanted to have wharfs around this end of the bay like here, that's all good. This is where the town is likely to be around this area. Oh, uh, well, likely to be. This is where the town has to be around this area. And um, so, yeah, I've put some wharfs around here. This end probably could be more. I might extend out a little wall down this way. I think I'll have to do that. Extend the wharf down this way a little bit. And then this area could be just like a, a I don't know, boating lake, uh, like park type lake. So I think that's what I'll have to do. Definitely, definitely. Now I'm thinking about it. Then we'll, the next episode, I'll bring a wharf down this way so that uh, that'll be finished. Now I've done a little bit of detailing down here as well. As you can tell, um, some rocks down here, a little bit of glitching going on at the moment. So that's something I need to adjust the terrain to get that to work. But that's not too bad a problem, to be honest with you. I'm not going to extend the trees much further up here, if at all. Maybe just a little bit of shrubs going down here because I want to encourage people to build down uh, this peninsula I think that'd be quite nice and maybe the posh houses or something like that down there and then over here this other side of this uh, of the uh, what we're we talking at the bay I guess a big old rock there and a couple of wharfs there with some uh, some foliage on it and that's basically so yeah what you missed what I built this week was basically this this rebuilt this added some trees around here 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 and all the way around here tidied up the sand there and I think I just did some tweaking with the trees down here, I think. I don't remember exactly now, but uh, I think I spent about five minutes on this section. So that's what you missed. Okay, I think I think we're pretty much sorted now. I, th <laughs> I think we are pretty much sorted now. Right, well thanks anyway for uh, watching, commenting, liking, and subscribing, and everything else. Where should, where should we go, where should we finish? Should we finish with uh, this little view here? I think this is a pretty reasonable view. 
Oh, is oh no, it's, no, 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 it's come out of that. No, no, too low. That's better. Yes, I think we'll finish with that. So yes, uh, thanks for all of that. Uh, I've got a new Facebook page, Bon Bon B. My uh, my Facebook page, sorry, it's not Bon Bon B. It is facebook.com forward slash official Bon Bon B. Because Bon Bon B is gone, strangely enough. Who would have that, eh? Um, so yes, uh, if you'd like to join me over there, that'd be great. And uh, yeah, join me tomorrow for What's Map. Don't forget, we're voting on What's Maps now. We're voting on them. Yeah, you can get your, your opinion at the end of every show. Anyway, thanks anyway. Have a great day. And hopefully next week, you'll be able to watch me doing some building rather than just flying over talking about things. I do hope so. <laughs> have a great week. See you very, very soon. <laughs>